Ahoy mateys and thanks for tuning in to Pirates and Teepees. Joshua Vesne here, KK6VHH. In this new series of videos, we are going to play with my Heath kit, HW29, aka The Sixer, amateur six meter transceiver radio. I got this off eBay. It's gonna need a few things to get it going and I do a series of videos showing you what I had to do to get this radio going. So this will be like the intro video, so we'll talk about this radio a little bit, be a little long-winded. We're gonna open up the box and kind of get an idea of what uh, needs to be done to get this radio working, and then you'll know what's gonna be coming up in the upcoming videos on the series. And so the last to do before we get to that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell to turn on notifications, and then that way you won't miss any upcoming videos. All right, here we go. Let's open this baby up. Okay, first thing uh, we see here is, as described in the auction, the microphone has uh, been broken. Uh, the connector has broken off. So we will do a video on that, repairing this microphone and how to properly solder a shielded connector onto something such as this. Next, we see uh, this requires a special power plug. There's this eight pin. It's called um, an octo eight pin plug. The same plugs that are used on tubes and some relays. Someone from my ham radio club, thanks Jim. WA8 MPA. Thank you so much for gifting me this plug here. It will plug into here and I found in the Heath kit manual how we're going to be able to wire this for 120 volts. It's going to require shorting a few of these pins out to uh, properly switch the power. All right, so that'll be the next video is making that power supply. But let's open this thing up and see what it looks like on the inside. There should be four screws back here. There's only two, which you know makes it a little easier to open up on this one here. If I want to get anal about it later, once I have it working, I might put all four screws in there. All right, opening up the lunch box. slides right off. This is how you'll see a lot of these radios online um, in the how-tos and stuff with just the uh, the box itself just off. All right, look, old school. We got tubes in here. We got wires that have like um, cl oiled cloth shielding. Um, all the components are big. This is going to be a great opportunity to learn about the real, like the Fund of basic fundamentals of radio. I'm hoping to eventually build a uh, radio from scrap parts found around here. Obviously, it won't have tubes, it'll have transistors, but um, I think I might have be able to find everything I need in like an old microwave oven or something. All right. I'll talk. Look at that. Someone built this by hand um, sometime, I think, before 1960. The ham license on the side of this radio. Uh, was issued in 1960 and inspired in 1965. And you see all like the large capacitors and resistors in there. Um, see how you know the plug comes out, goes through these different fuses, um, through the on-off switch, which uh, controls everything. So that's why when we make the plug here, we're going to have to short some pins out according to the manual in order to get things connected the way that we want. Um, the final thing we're going to do is we're going to replace this RCA antenna connector with um, is that a PL239 or something like that. So that'll mount right there on the outside and um, that should wire right in there uh, fairly easily. So we might need a little bit longer wire here. I can't reach the new plug, but that'll be easy to figure out. I think that's about it for now. So assuming everything goes well, those will be the upcoming videos. Uh, once again, thanks so much for tubing in. Please hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video. Also hit the like and leave me some comments, any tips or whatever. I love comments. All right, and I try really hard to respond to everyone. All right, everyone, have be healthy and happy and safe out there. 73 KK6 VHH over and out. Check out these videos. What about this video? Ooh, oh yeah, yeah. Okay, right here, right here.